a brain MRI scan showing a tumor. Voice of Mark Gilbert, MD, co-lead of the NCI Connect program. Brain tumors are a relatively uncommon form of cancer. A person laying down in an MRI scanner. Dr. Gilbert sits in his office as he speaks. Less than 2% of all cancers are brain tumors, but yet, given their difficulty in treatment, given the consequence to the patients, it is a, a significant area uh, of concern. Marta Penas Prado, MD, NCI Connect senior clinician, sitting in an office. NCI Connect is focusing on the rarest of brain and spine tumors because they have not been the focus of attention for a very long time, and therefore they are in need of a specialized care and also better therapies. A doctor's hand grasping a patient's hand and a researcher pipetting clear liquid into a tube in lab. Terry Armstrong, PhD, NCI Connect co-lead, sits in her office. We try to provide a comprehensive approach, doing basic science, doing clinical trials, and reaching out to the community. An aerial view of the NIH Clinical Center. A sign that says, Clinical Center, Building 10, South Entrance. A group of NIH nurse practitioners smile outside for a photo. So in addition to therapeutic studies or treatment studies, we have studies that help us evaluate ways that we can support people during their day-to-day -day life and we're able to create a sense of community for patients who come here. Dr. Armstrong smiling outside, taking butterflies out of a box and letting them perch on her fingers. Close up of another person smiling while they hold a butterfly in their palm before it flies away. Dr. Gilbert speaking in his office. We are taking a comprehensive multidisciplinary approach to develop paradigms that can be used in the investigation of other rare tumors. A researcher in lab pipetting a red liquid into a well plate, and another researcher at a computer examining data. Dr. Penis Prado speaking in an office. The advances I hope to see in the next five to 10 years include better diagnosis for the more uncommon tumors. Dr. Gilbert gives a speech outside to a group of seated and standing people who are all NIH neuro-oncology professionals. We are seeing now with the introduction of new testing techniques for diagnosis that new tumors are being described. And once we give them their appropriate name, we will be able to understand their clinical course better and develop better treatments for them. Dr. Penis Prado and another attendee clap as they listen to Dr. Gilbert's speech. On a nearby picnic table, there are plastic butterflies, bracelets that say fight brain tumors, and butterfly-shaped pins. Other event goers hold either real butterflies or plastic butterflies on sticks while laughing and interacting with one another. Dr. Armstrong speaking in her office. I think knowledge is power, and if we can generate that knowledge through the community or through the really foundational research that we're doing here, hopefully we can make a difference. NIH neuro-oncology professionals outside holding plastic butterflies on sticks and smiling. A panning view of Drs. Gilbert, Armstrong, and Penis Prado with two other members of the brain tumor community. NIH National Cancer Institute logo.